So you want to write to somebody because you're interested in doing a PhD with them or a postdoc or a research visit or an internship. And so many of us receive several of those a week, which uh, taken for the entire year probably amounts to several hundred of these requests. And I'm sure many other labs are in the same situation. So it's important for you to stand out. So everybody writes, um, uh, well, we would like to learn from you in this lab and we have read your papers, especially this paper and that paper, and this is, this is fine. But how you stand out is, well, I have this background and I know this method or this analytical technique or this statistical tool. And I've seen from your previous work that you don't have that represented in your group. And therefore this is something that I could contribute to your lab. When you write something like that, either directly or sort of between the lines, no matter what's your style and your culture, basically, you will immediately stand out from the masses. And I think it will help you a lot getting the internship or position that you're really interested in. And I've said this before in another video that I'll link to in the description or here, um, don't make people ask for your CV. Make sure that when you send that first request, you also append a CV and that lists your relevant experience as well and documents it. So this is very important. The first impression basically makes or, or breaks this in many, many times. So make sure you get this right and emphasize what you can actually bring to the team and that you, by that you also convey the notion that you have thought about it. You have thought about what that lab currently is all about what your background is and how you can contribute to the mission of the group it'll make you stand out guaranteed so this is pretty simple but i think you'd be surprised how few people actually do that so this will make you stand out